Hey there guys, this is Wesnator88 here and I'm back again with an episode of Fishing Planet. Yes guys, Fishing Planet and as you can see, the Halloween event is on. Because uh, obviously it's got the little symbol for the, these pumpkins. Uh, which indicate that you can get the actual pumpkins. You get a few items from all. It'll be uh, tombstones where you get some of the items for. But in today's episode, we're going to go to Emerald Lake quickly. And hopefully get the uh, scary kayaking at Emerald done. Make a bit of cash and a bit of bait. Now, unfortunately, I won't be using the Quanchkin Lake Pass for one day because I probably won't get time to actually go there. And it's just my stuff ain't going to be high enough for that. But at least we'll get a pumpkin bobber. Now, obviously, as you can tell, I've got a candle end on me, which is in my inventory. Put that over there. Obviously, for the Halloween event, so. Try and make sure I ain't got any others in there. No. Nope. So we need to take that with us when we do this event. And obviously we need to make sure we've got enough cash to obviously travel there. And to pay for the boat. Now obviously I haven't got enough for the license and the boat at the same time. So hopefully if I can get this challenge done without any problems, I won't need to worry. So we're going to travel. I'll make sure that I've got everything on me firstly. Got that lot. Got the bait I need. Got that. Don't need to worry too much about that. Okay, right. So, let's travel to Emerald Lake. Yes. We know. Like I say, because I'm just going to do the boat, I don't need to worry about it. So, go there. Yes. Go fish. I don't need to worry about the license. So, only if I'm fishing there, that's when I have to worry about the license. Now, the thing is, it wants me to travel till it's night time. Which mostly seems almost like a waste of it. But. But. Um, it shouldn't be too much of a problem. Put that there. Um, and obviously, I have no license, so. Technically, boat fishing isn't allowed, and obviously. Nighttime boat fishing isn't allowed. Uh, so yeah, boat fishing forbidden. We've only got the basic. But we'll mostly go for the advanced ones so we can actually fish at uh, day and night. But yeah. Anyway. I need to find, to see if I can find these tombstones, which I'm pretty sure is actually on that island over there. So we're going to quickly get the pumpkin. Got some candy. As much as I really don't want to have to waste this on the nighttime part. And obviously, what you need to make sure you do is track the event because this is going to make more sense. So, obviously, I've got the candle on me. Gotta go there. But it has to be nighttime. And it's going to make us use that. So, we'll rent that. And because we're not actually fishing fine. Uh, just to make sure I'm not in anyone's way, I'm actually going to go to a private room. Fish yes, I know it's strongly advised that we don't fish without a license, yes, but if I'm not fishing, I don't need to worry about the license. Ah, the game. Right, so we're going to get on the boat, yes, confirm. And we're going to quickly move ourselves over this way slightly very quickly because as you can see in the distance there is another pumpkin which is actually new because before there was only the one <coughs> um, which is obviously where we got but I guess they've added another pumpkin on this map which is actually a surprise um, hold on is there they added something else in there? Or is that just my eyes? Just, I'll have to check that. Looks like they added something else over there. I'll have a little look anyway. Do it from shore, hopefully. Right, go to shore. Now, can, as you may have heard, the actual tombstones do make a noise. And we've got a hairball. That's awesome. It's not, but um, and yeah, they've added some more pumpkins in the matches. Okay, 
That is interesting. I guess they're trying to give people more of a chance of getting sent items. Uh, <clears throat> now, I know uh, sometimes you'll hear people say, oh, but you can get these things for the event in the shops. You can't. I have to have traveled to the location. They've not given us any other items. Um, yes, confirm, I know. Yeah, it looks like this year they've actually added a few more pump pumpkins in the matches. Or the maps, I should say. <coughs> I'll have to check on the console version, see if they've added more support of St. Croix. Because that has quite a lot of tombstones. Uh, and it's a pretty big map. Which I'm be surprised if they hadn't, but... Yes, very, very interesting. Anyway, I know a lot of people are like, well, when are you going to get to the race part? Don't worry, I will. I'm just going to show you. Emerald Lake for the Halloween. There we go. Interact. And we got a new... We didn't get another candle out, so I've got one chance of getting this done today. Confirm. And what I'm going to do, just to get myself back a bit quicker, is I'm going to do that. As it brings you straight back to where you are at. Get on the boat. Give me a stamina recharge back up first. And then I'm just going to find myself a good position. Now, if I had... More of the uh, candle. So I'd be trying to get it all done. So let's just hope. It's, no, it's not letting me for my stamina. So I usually go to the shore and usually stamina recharge back up, but it's not at the minute. Um, so I'm not going to take the rod out because obviously I am not actually fishing. Like I say, you can use the boats, you can do these events, and you don't need to pay for the license, guys. So if you went to the Falcon Lake, the, the kayaking, you don't need to pay for a license. The only time you need to pay for a license for fishing is if you're actually fishing. If you're just going around on the boat, you don't need to have a license for it. Because as long as you don't fish, you're not going to get a fine. You only get a fine if you actually fish. Sure. I'm not sure about that. Yes, I am. Right. T. Forward. Yes. For catching fish at night, it is required to have an advanced license. Close. I am not fishing. Right. You have to sacrifice the candle. Starts the race. Board, yes. <laughs> Obviously, we've got a couple of mats and it's already wasted a few. Right, come on. Right. So, we're going to try and get a good sprint on these. I'm going to turn. Now, by going in the diagonal, it's actually surprising. It actually does work. Come on. Because these actually seem to be a bit closer than what the rest are. Now, if you do actually own one of your own kayaks and they're a bit faster, use one of them. Uh, it might be a little bit easier, but this is a good enough event that you shouldn't need to worry about using a different one. Uh, come on. As you can see, I am actually getting these. Now, I don't even have a kayak yet. Right, that is 
just really fast. So if I let it rest or not, it's still gonna do it. <sighs> oh well. Um I was hoping this would be a little bit easier. <laughs> no, it's alright. I'll get this done pretty much without too much of a worry. I'll take a turn here. All I need is just three more. So I'll get this one and the next one ahead, and I'll take the one to the left of me. So all I've done then is gone into a circle, really, for it all. And Shouldn't be too much of a problem. Now, I hope to test out this year, if not, I'll do it on the console version, that you're supposed to be able to catch the uh, monster fish. Again, if, and only if, you still have the stuff, and it's around Halloween time, you can get them more than once. Apparently, <coughs> it's what the theory is, because obviously, the only time to get more than one of the... Uh, most fish is if you have your bait out. And you try and bring it all in before your first one comes in, but anyway, that'll be for a different side. So yeah, we got that done. Got the six 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 cash and the one bait coin for getting the So cash pumpkin bobber and the crunchkin pass for a day. Which makes no difference because I won't be able to go. Anyway. So two candle ends and one noose for a pumpkin and tomb. Don't forget to put them in your arm. And that's for St. Croix. Hold on. Oh, I've got to go to Falcon. But that will give you a pass for St. Croix, which kind of works better. Um, unfortunately, I'm not going there. Not on this one, anyway. <laughs> right, travel to the... Yes, I know. So, obviously, because we've got that bit of the mission done, it's obviously activate the next one. Which we're on track because I don't think I'll be at the level to actually go there. Uh, now I would go to the St. Croix. St. Croix. I have you want to pronounce it, guys, it's up to you. Let's go and catch the uh, witch's pet catfish at night with, you know, Halloween bait. You know, I've got, I think, the moldy cheese. Um, maybe I've now got the sour bread, I'm not sure. Um, no, just the moldy cheese. Unfortunately, I don't have any dried locusts, but my rod, especially my feeder, or even my float rod, are not strong enough to handle the catfish at St. Croix. So I'm not going to be doing that. Anyway, guys, hopefully you enjoyed today's episode. I know it's a bit short, um, but it is the Halloween event, so hopefully this helped you guys out a little bit. I'm hoping that for the next episode, I will have... I'll be able to do this fishing event, hopefully, which is obviously later on today, which I am make sure I've got enough. I do, so I'm now going to apply for that. <laughs> oh, I don't need that, and I should still have enough to pay for the license to fish there. Uh, unfortunately, if it gets cancelled, I won't be fishing it. I'll wait till hopefully I think it's like Wednesday. I think, yeah, Wednesday will be the next one, um, which is pretty early in the morning. So hopefully, no, it's not in the morning. Yeah, it is, it is early in the morning. So hopefully I'll be able to do that one uh, without any problems, I'm hoping. And then you guys will get that video actually out on the Wednesday. And then afterwards, uh, hopefully I'll try and get uh, the next lot of missions done. I'm hoping. Unless I complete the other one, then I'll be doing it a bit sooner. Anyway, guys. I like say thank you for being here. Hope you enjoy your Halloween because obviously it's getting pretty close and hopefully this was very helpful. I'll go over my rod setup tomorrow for the event, which will be the, my float rod here. And hopefully it will help you guys out. Anyway, hope you enjoy. Stay safe and uh, enjoy your Halloween, guys. And I'll see you on the lake. Bye for now.